We, we can't, can't see you. Where are you guys? Come on, buddies. There we go. Good morning, Tri Central. I'm Millie. And I'm Eli. Welcome to WTCE News. Today is Tuesday, November 21st, and it is our 71st day of school. And it's our last day before Thanksgiving break! Now it's time for our Pledge of Allegiance and Moment of Silence. Please stand up, cover your heart, and join us in saying the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, and under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. new lifeline to work on this month. It is kindness. It means to be helpful and caring. Let's say the life goal pledge for kindness today. Repeat what you hear and do the hand motions with me. I will do the right thing. I will do the right thing. I will treat people right. I will treat people right. I will be helpful helpful and caring. I will be helpful and caring. I will choose to be kind. I will choose to be kind. Today for lunch, we are having chicken nuggets, mashed potatoes, corn, applesauce, cup, and milk. Yummy! Happy birthday today to Jaden H, Jordan H, Landon M, Nolan M, Nolan V, over Thanksgiving break, Braylon, M, Braylon H, Carter L, LEC, Dakota E, Kaya C, and Carter D will be celebrating. Please go to the office for a pencil and a birthday wish. Happy birthday! It's cardboard challenge time, and some of our fourth grade graders have a box it, box -it tech story to share with you today. Please stay tuned after announcements to listen to their story. Thank you, Miss Scarce's fourth graders. Don't forget, we are not in school on Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. It's Thanksgiving break! It's mindful moment time. Please listen and follow along. Sit up tall and hold your body still. Take a long breath in and let it all the way out. Think of something kind you've done for someone. Maybe you helped someone in your family with something at home, or you helped a friend at school. How about something kind that someone else did for you? Maybe someone did a really nice thing for you recently. Think about how it made you feel. Now think of something kind that you haven't done yet. But you will the next time you have a chance. Is there someone you could help or say some kind words to? Try to remember to do that kind thing whenever you can. Sit up tall again. Take one more big breath in. And let it all the way out. Remember, it's important to settle yourself before you start your day. Let's get our day started. Please say the Miller motto with me. Treat people right and do the right thing and you'll have peace. And happy Thanksgiving! Today we're going to read Box of Text by Kim Smith. Love making.
making tiny houses, tall towers, and twisty tunnels. And she made marvelous, marvelous things no one had ever seen before. Meg was proud of her work. She could make boxes into anything. Meg's mother was proud too. She thought Meg was brilliant and creative. So Meg's mother sent Meg to Maker School, where she could be even more brilliant and creative. At Maker School, there were blank blanketeers, spaghetti texts, tin folders, and egg cartoners. Egg cartoners. There was almost any kind of maker you could imagine. But Meg was the class first box detect, and that made her feel special. At Maker School, Meg learned all about box structure. She learned how to make her structures useful, strong, and beautiful. Meg loved everything about Maker School. Until Simo showed up. Like Meg, Simo was no. She was also brilliant and creative. Worst of all, Simo was a box tech too. And she was already making things Meg had never dreamed of. In class, Simone would point out ways Meg could make her constructions a little straighter, more wind resistant, and less boring. So Meg told Simone she would build things that were less bumpy, sturdier, and much prettier. grew bigger and bigger. They both built and built until there wasn't a single box left. And at last, they finished, what is it, asked a classmate. I'll never see seen anything like it, said another. The teacher said, it looks like it might. Working as a team, Meg and Simone. 
something new at the end of the makers match the boxer tricks piece <laughs> haven't won first place but they had a different way of making brilliant and creative things working together and we each games a new friends what should we make next how about a bone Mansion.